All right, so there's been major news with Paige Pierce that is definitely going to shake up her season. Let's get into it. So while you could say that Paige's season may not be the most stellar, it is still pretty darn good with two wins and some top 10 finishes. But that is all coming to a crushing close for this season, at least it looks like, because I guess she was in Norway preparing for the Sula Open And it just so happened that she was on a slippery bridge, broke her leg, and had to get metal plates and screws in her leg. So while this is very tragic, I do not foresee her really coming out of this for probably a couple months, if not the rest of the season. And while this is a major tragedy, there has been some good that has come out of it because looking at the comments, there is so much love and support from all the pros. And you can see that this really is a community of people that genuinely care about each other. And there's just so much love and support for Paige. And it just really goes to show that disc golf truly is a community of people that care about each other. So looking at her season, she really was doing pretty good, I would say. She may not have attended that many events, missing all the Silver Series, but she still did pretty good at every event she was at. Sure, 16th at Waco, 27th at Music City Open, and 29th at Champions Cup. Not the best, but this is kind of the new era where there's just so much competition and so many people that are willing to fight to get these wins, and it's just a lot more competitive of an environment. So I think she's still doing very, very good. And you can definitely tell that while her mind may be out of it at a couple of these events, her skill level has not declined one bit. And I think you can see that in these top 10 finishes and the couple of wins that she has so far. And looking at her schedule, she really has packed up a ton of events that I didn't actually foresee her playing in every single one of these. So basically every major or elite series she was going to be participating in. And according to her post, she's going to be back in a few months. Um, but looking at the severity of this injury, I foresee it being a lot longer if she does want to look after her recovery in the most cautious way. And Paige is definitely not one of the youngest players. She is aging a little bit, so I think it is definitely in her best interest to really treat this injury with a lot more care than you would if you're like 21 years old. And I think it's kind of the same regard as Eagle with his injuries. You really want to take care of it at the onset of it and not overdo it because things can get much, much worse very fast if you try to get into a tournament too fast before you're actually ready for it because that can just cause crazy re-injury and a lot of bad things that you do not want to do, especially for a pro. So only time will tell what the actual outcome of this is going to be because right now it does look pretty severe and not that hopeful, but she is a professional athlete. So I definitely think that she'll do what's in her best interest. So what do you guys think? I would love to hear about it. This is definitely some very interesting news and I really do wish her the best and a very speedy recovery. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe. Wild Runs signing out. Peace.